Hello everybody, this is Jesse from Napco Tech Support, and today in this video I'm going to show you how to program your SLE Wi-Fi module to a Starlink commercial fire radio, and this can also be used with a Starlink Connect radio. You're going to have to make sure that the SLE Wi-Fi module is already installed on the radio, and the radio is powered up and registered and programmed. Then you're going to go to the NapcoNoc2.com and go to the Communication Cell and or IP tab. Click Edit. We're going to pick IP with cell radio backup for a fire radio, enable IP supervision because it's a commercial radio for fire. Configuration type is going to be Wi-Fi is the only IP path. Now you can click search and it will do a search for all networks that are available to the Wi-Fi module. And you can pick it here or if you know exactly what it is, you can manually input the SSID. You will also need to know the router's password and this must be connected to a 2.4 gigahertz router only. The SLE Wi-Fi module will not connect to a 5 gigahertz wireless router. And once all the information is entered, you're going to click save and send the download to the radio. Now once the download goes through to the radio, the radio is going to reboot itself and the signal should start coming in through the Wi-Fi path. As you can see, the radio has rebooted itself. We're now in the signal log, and you can see that the signals are now coming in on the Wi-Fi path. Now, just to review, we went over how to program your SLE commercial fire radio or Starlink Connect radio um, using the SLE Wi-Fi module to connect to a 2.4 gigahertz wireless router. And as always, for more information, you can visit us on the web at tech.napcosecurity.com. Thank you all for watching.